In this video, we'll look at whether potassium bromide, that's KBR, is soluble or insoluble in water. There's three ways we can do this. First, we could have memorized the solubility rules. So here's just a brief set of the most important solubility rules. As we look down, we see group one elements, group one on the periodic table. Those are gonna be soluble and potassium's in group one. So we would expect KBR would be a soluble compound according to our rules here. We could also look at a solubility chart. So here's our solubility chart. We find potassium right here, that's K plus, and then we're looking for the bromide, which is actually right here next to it. So we go down and we see potassium bromide has an S. That S means that it's soluble in water. When you put this in water, it'll dissolve, it'll dissociate into its ions. You'll have K plus aqueous, and then the bromide ion aqueous as well. There is one more way we could tell whether KBR is soluble or insoluble in water. We could just get some solid KBR and put it in water, see what happens, see if it dissolved. Based on the solubility rules and our solubility chart, we would expect that it would dissolve. It would be soluble in water. So in answer to our question, KBR, potassium bromide, that's soluble in water. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.